So the Smart Board Revolution is a social network on the Ning site. Um, you create an account and you can post uh, their forums, you can post videos, pictures, uh, people ask questions and get help from other teachers, other technology coordinators who are joined, their smart uh, employees that have joined and answer questions, technical questions. Smartboard Revolution Ning, you can find help. Um, there are forums where teachers post questions, this isn't working, or how do I do this? Uh, there are announcements of conferences in different areas. There's a forum for conference. You can find training materials that uh, several trainers, people that do staff development have uploaded. Uh, we do have connected to a wiki space. We do have a site where we can post lessons, but hasn't really taken off. It's not the easiest way to do it. Um, people have done videos, or the videos that I originally put there on how to do things, but other people have uploaded videos. Um, really, it's, it's a good place to get help for whatever you need. The level of expertise that's the members is incredible. So, you know, if you have a question, if you need help, call the Smart Board Revolution team. I mean, it just, you will get answers. And it, you know, it's really nice that you can find those quickly. I think probably one of the biggest needs is now getting to, you know, we, we've all learned, a lot of us have learned the, how to make lessons and stuff, but kind of getting to the pedagogy behind it now. How do we change what we do as teachers to get the kids interacting and not just up at the board one at a time, but all together. I never thought that it would be 8,700 members. You know, I, I had started another one kind of at the same time with teaching ELLs using technology and I don't know, I got up to about 75 members and then it just kind of never went anywhere and nobody ever did anything on it and I just, ended up killing it, you know, and I started them about the same time, right? So when that one got to 75, this one was, you know, at 275 or something, and I, get, I just saw that, well, I guess I'll keep this one around. When I look at the statistics of who's visiting the site, um, it is mostly the United States, then Canada, then United Kingdom, Australia, and then from there, you know, all over. From the Maldives, you know, we got one hit per month or whatever. But, you know, there's a lot of, it's worldwide, you know, we have members from all over. And uh, it's interesting to get other perspectives, um, to get, to see that right, we have the same issues in different parts of the world but also just learn from the other people. It's kind of exciting, it's interesting to be part of something like that.